Hello, I'm DJ Townsend. I'm 36. Um, I have a fun job. I can sell boats for a living. Um, and this year has been an incredible year. Um, very busy dad with two daughters and a nephew that might as well be mine. Um, he's with me all the time. We go fishing and all that good stuff. Um, just again, very busy. But this whole program has been incredible so far. Awesome. And what were your big breakthroughs, specific results that you got from our Precision Lifestyle program? So I've been doing it a month and a half. And the biggest goal from day one was to lose 50 pounds, get back down to about that 200 weight, um, which is where I was back in college. So that was many years ago. Um, back then, I was playing soccer seven days a week. Now, I'm working my butt off in the gym and abiding by our nutrition plan. And it's just working killer. Awesome. So we're down 25 pounds. And... 20, I'm right at 25 pounds in a month and a half. Awesome. What other changes are you seeing in your body? Like definition, pants fitting better, change of shirt sizes. Tell me about that. I'm about to have to buy a new belt because I'm out of belt loops going the opposite direction. Oh my God. <laughs> so, um, back in the day, it was like a 38 belt. And now it's, I don't know, we're on the last hole and it's going to go away soon too. So, oh, so we got to um, go shopping pretty soon. That's it. Shirts are feeling real loose. Um, shorts, they pretty much just slide down without a belt. Um, as far as physically feeling or seeing, um, I can definitely tell, especially in the shoulders, arms, uh, chest, the, uh, which I've always been very self-conscious about my chest because I'm like, yeah, you're not in the greatest shape. Well, this whole program has kind of changed all that, and I'll run around shirtless all the time. <laughs> so, nice. Whereas before, were you – what, what I'll you put doing? a tank top on and call it good. Now yeah. I'll take the whole thing off because it's hot outside. <laughs> nice. So more confident with your body. I love it. 100%. And, and what were you struggling with before you started with our program? Um, I mean, just overall appearance. Like when I brush my teeth, certain parts of my body don't need a jiggle. Okay. Uh, but, you know, being in the, in the outdoors business, we live outside. So we're always at the lake. We found one looks like a big old tub out there. Um, especially with my kids, I want to really try and prove them that this is possible. It is maintainable and it is sustainable. Heck yeah. And what were you skeptical of? Um, really just my own motivation. Uh, but thanks to you and Rob, I mean, you guys, a lot of fire in our tails that, you know, it's, it's showtime. Whenever we sign up, it's, it's go time. Awesome. And what held you back from taking action sooner? Um, that's a great question. It's probably got multiple answers, but, uh, really just trying to find myself and to get my motivation back. And then, you know, having conversations with my boss and kind of potential promotions that could happen, blah, blah, blah on that. Um, but then I got to thinking like, Hey, my kids are following in my footsteps and if they're going to be doing what I do, I don't want them at my age to look like I do. I want them to be fit kids. And, you know, it really starts with me um, because I'm, they're going to follow my lead. Well, that's what we all did. And if I look at my parents, kind of the same, kind of the same MO. Um, so I want to change that for them too. Awesome. And was there something that happened that convinced you to finally take action? Uh, I looked in the mirror one day and it was like, oh, I had zero energy, um, no motivation really to do anything besides go to work, come home, sit on the couch, and eat uh, little fudge trap cookies, which is pretty amazing. <laughs> Even though I haven't had one in a month and a half. Wow. So basically, you just looked at yourself in the mirror and you said, what happens? I could do better. Yeah, I mean, it's like the blink of an eye. I mean, the world moves so fast, and, you know, working six days a week, it really doesn't lend a whole lot of time to really carve out, but in this journey that we're on together, um, you know, an hour here, an hour every single day, is, that's where I'm at right now. And it's been stellar results so far. Got it. And how has this impacted other areas in your life? Um, I'd like to say it's helped definitely with my confidence, um, which in the sales world, selling boats, I mean, you got to be able to sell yourself too, because that's what people buy from is people they love. Um, but it also gives me the energy to go do whatever I want to do at any hours. Um, you know, play with the kids all night and then wake up, go to work, come back, do it all over again. So That's awesome. just confidence is the biggest thing. That's awesome. How's that affected your sales at your job? And how has it affected your role as a dad? 
being a dad's always a blast, but now that we're all sitting there measuring foods together, um, and then watching them sit there with the little, uh, the bands or the little five pound weights, just really get trying to, again, follow my lead. Cause that's what they do. Um, it's been great as far as the sales part of it. This has been kind of a crazy year with work. Um, with the whole COVID thing, life has kind of went on kind of overdrive with boats. Um, we're having a killer year, but, um, I think having a great attitude is really a benefit to that. Um, Whereas you go back last year, again, really good year, but I was always tired. Now I'm, hey, we can party all day. That's awesome. So higher energy with your kids and higher quality experiences with them. You're teaching them about That's food. That's it. That's awesome. Tell me a little bit about how it's affected you professionally. Tell me about, you know, the increase in sales that you've had. So again, I mean, I'm not going to blame anything on the COVID-19 thing, really just kind of increasing sales. But as far as like my personal, I'm going to make sure that every single person gets treated like they get the best service you're going to ever find. And it's because I feel really good about myself. Okay. Um, you know, I've got the highest energy level here in the store, I feel. Um, plus at the same time, like I've always got a great attitude, but now it's multiplied by like a hundred. So like at all times, I'm in a great mood, ready to go, I'll do whatever needed. And again, that is all um, contagious. Um, so as far as professionalism, like me being here in my office, as soon as I step out the door, they all see that I'm, you know, I'm the young chicken now. Um, and they're again, all gonna, it's like having kids, they're gonna follow your lead. So, you know, everybody kind of changes their mindset when one person kind of gets started and then a second one, then a third one, and it's just kind of, spirals from there. I love that. Not only are you caring for your customers in a deeper way and bringing more energy and focus to them during the, during your meetings with them, but you're also being a leader in your workspace. It sounds like the people that you're working with are starting to follow your lead. And, yep. adapt and what's funny is when, when I first brought it up, like the whole game plan, what, what I was trying to do and all that. And they're like, Oh, come on, man. I know how this goes and blah, blah, blah. And now all of them are starting to bring their own lunches, which consist of apples, mandarin oranges, bananas, salads. It's just, it's pretty cool. That is freaking cool. See, you are changing lives by starting with yourself, leading by example. Yep. That's leadership right there. Yep. So DJ, what would you say to yourself? Maybe the person that just started, DJ, that, that just started on day one, maybe a little scared, maybe a little bit nervous. What would you say to you? the beginner you on day one? Just grind through it. There's going to be a lot of learning curves, um, but it is 100% doable. Um, I, I, again, I went from eating Taco Bell five days a week to I bring a turkey sandwich for lunch and way better nutrition and just overall a lot more energy. Um, just feel really good about myself and kind of where I'm at right now. That's awesome. So, biggest thing is don't give up. You see one little setback where, you know, the scale went from 250 to 252 and your goal is 200, you know, two pounds, it'll come back off as long as you put in the work. That's awesome, DJ. And do you feel like this is sustainable, what you're doing right now? Absolutely. I mean, I've got, I've got goals that are still, you know, 40 pounds away from where we're at right now. Um, but it's absolutely because it's all, it, again, like when we were, you put out a post about the, um, the name of the whole program and it's a lifestyle change. It's not a fitness program. This is a complete lifestyle change. That's awesome. DJ, is there anything else that you want to share to other people, other dads who are super busy, can't make time for themselves, always putting themselves in the back seats, the breadwinners of the family that have to balance work, family, and now themselves, like what would you say to a really busy dad? Don't wait till tomorrow to start the program. Do not wait till tomorrow. Start right now. And that's where it's at. Um, I, again, I waited till tomorrow for way too long. And I wish I could go back sick. Well, a long time ago, started then and see where I'm at now. But, you know, I started a month and a half ago. Today is the day to start if they're even considering it. Awesome.